Hello everyone, welcome to BSP Solution. My name is Shivam Temre. In today's session, we will see Oracle Fusion Supply Chain Management Common Configuration Part 8 Primary Ledger. So first of all, what is Ledger? A Ledger is a record of all the accounts that company uses. Now the Primary Ledger. So a Primary Ledger in Oracle Fusion Cloud is where all the primary accounting information will be maintained. Primary ledger is nothing but a main record keeping ledger and a required component in our configuration. Every accounting configuration is a uniquely identified by its primary ledger. The primary ledger is closely associated with the sub ledger transaction and provide context accounting for them. Primary ledger records all tran transactional balances by using four C's. So what are the four C's? Four C's are charts of accounts, accounting calendar, currencies, accounting rules implemented in accounting method. Now, what is in primary ledger. So we have seen in our earlier session how to create charts of accounts, accounting calendar and currencies. We create charts of account with multiple tasks, accounting calendar with task name is manage accounting calendar, currency with manage currencies, now last one is the accounting method. Accounting method group sub ledger general entity rule sets. Accounting method facilitates the definition of consistent accounting treatment for each accounting event class and accounting event type for all sub ledger application. By assigning a different sub ledger accounting to each related ledger, you can create a multiple accounting representation of transaction. Now let's go to instance and create a primary ledger. Okay. Now sign in as Tata user, click on setting and action, then click on setup and maintenance. Click on task and manage implementation project, open manage implementation project, open our project, Tata implementation project, click on Tata implementation project. Search the task name as manage primary ledger. Click on search icon. Okay, we have multiple parts over here. Click on manage primary ledger. We go with financial defined accounting configuration path. Click on go to task icon, manage primary ledger, go to task. Here, a option called create. Click on create icon for creating primary ledger. Now, we have seen the multiple mandatory fields over here. Name, charts of account, accounting calendar and the currency. First of all, provide name for our primary ledger. Let's say Tata Primary Ledger. Okay. Description is not mandatory field over here. Now select our chart of account. We already created in our last session. Tata structure instance. Accounting calendar we already created as Tata Cal. Select the Tata Cal currency, uh, multiple currencies, many options for currency like Euros, Yen, Afghanis, okay, Austral and Taka and Multum. Let's select USD or accounting method that is the standard QL. So, this is how we define forces in our primary ledger for these are charts of accounts accounting calendar currencies accounting method okay click on save and close now after creating the primary ledger we have to specify the ledger options okay let's wait No. Okay. After creating primary ledger, we have to specify the 
लेजर ऑप्शन इन सिलेक्टेड स्कोप कॉलम सिलेक्ट यर स्पेसिफाई लेजर ऑप्शन प्राइमरी लेजर सिलेक्ट एन एड क्लिक ऑन सिलेक्ट एन एड अप्लाई एंड गो टू टास्क क्लिक ऑन अप्लाई एंड गो टू टास्क हेयर वी हैव टू सर्च फॉर अवर प्राइमरी लेजर दैट इज टाटा क्लिक ऑन सर्च यर अवर प्राइमरी लेजर प्राइमरी लेजर नेम इज टाटा प्राइमरी लेजर charts of account name is tata structure instance accounting calendar is tata cal currency is usd status is in process okay select that row click on save and close okay now in specify laser option here we need to define all the laser option this is our general information for our primary laser that is name tata primary laser that is a part of four series charts of accounts currencies accounting calendar accounting method so currency is usd charts of account is tata structured instance accounting calendar is already selected tata cal first open period we already selected and the number of future interable periods that is one we have selected in tata टाटा कैल वाइल बी क्रिएटिंग अकाउंटिंग कैलेंडर स्क्रोल इट डाउन इन दिस सब लेजर अकाउंटिंग वी हैव मल्टीपल अकाउंटिंग मैथड्स इन लाइक स्टैंडर्ड एक्ल स्टैंडर्ड एक्ल विथ इनकम रेंसेस ओके सो स्टैंडर्ड एक्ल स्टैंडर्ड एक्ल इज नथिंग बट दी रेवेन्यू एंड ओके आफ्टर सिलेक्टिंग द अकाउंटिंग मैथड वी हैव टू सिलेक्ट जनरल लैंग्वेज क्लिक हो य सिलेक्टर्स अमेरिकन इंग्लिश ओके ओके यूएस अमेरिकन इंग्लिश ओके एंड एट द पीरियड क्लोज हियर मैंडेटरी फील्ड इज रिटेन अर्निंग अकाउंट वी नीड टू स्पेसिफाई रिटेन अर्निंग अकाउंट सो रिटेन अर्निंग आर द्यूमुलेटिव प्रॉफिट दैट रिमेन्स आफ्टर अ कंपनी पे डिविडेंड्स टू इट्स शेयर होल्डर now here select retained earning account click on that okay we just need to fill all the details related to retained earning accounts like company department accounted we created in our charts of account structure select company as okay finance services department as finance select any account select stfc's account for retaining purpose click on okay okay now in accordance to your use you can select other account as well like cumulative translation adjustment accounts we have multiple accounts over here all the other details are optional like general processing we have all other details that are optional in accordance to your use you can select it okay we have fill all the mandatory field over here click on save and close icon okay as you see as you seen over here in selected scope in selected scope tata primary laser is already associated with all assigned legal entity specify laser option okay so once you completed specify laser option our primary laser will appear in the column okay so this is all about the primary laser in oracle fusion application okay thanks for watching the video thank you so much